नमस्ते फ्रेंड्स ओविलेशन इट हेज बिकम अ बिग क्वेश्चन वट इज ओविलेशन बेसिकली वी ऑल नो अबाउट ओविलेशन इज दैट रिलीज ऑफ एग फ्रॉम एन ओवरी ऑन डे ट्वेल्व और डे फोर्टीन ऑफ अ साइकिल इज नॉन एज ओविलेशन बट वट एक्चुअली दिस रिलीज ऑफ एग इज वेन डज इट हैपन एंड हाउ डज इट हैपन एंड वाई इज इट सो इम्पॉर्टेंट फॉर अ प्रेगनेंसी that we'll discuss today in this video from the day your menstrual menstrual cycle starts your both ovaries release few follicles these follicles are premature follicles up to the day 7 of your cycle these follicles grow and there is a intermittent fight between these follicles that the survival of the fittest will be there so one or two follicles from both the ovaries becomes the dominant follicles so these dominant follicles give a trigger to your brain and tell yes we have become the fittest and now we will grow so you go and start preparation of that bed of that endometrium in the uterus so that if fertilization happens in the body then that should be a bed for the embryo this way the estrogen hormone is released similarly on the other side this dominant follicle starts growing from day 7 to day 12 or day 14 there is a significant size of this dominant follicle till the time it grows and ruptures this size is 18 to 22 mm during this period when this dominant follicle is growing basically the female egg or the female seed is growing inside it this female egg or female seed is known as the ovum so when your dominant follicle matures up to 18 to 22 mm this seed is ready to get released out of the ovary this way when it is at this matured size your body gives again signal to your brain that hypothalamus and pituitary knock knock i am at the correct stage and my endometrium is prepared and this egg is prepared so release the hormone in uh, luteinizing hormone so that this egg can get ruptured so then luteinizing hormone is released and this egg starts rupturing the moment this egg ruptures there are tubes in our reproductive system which are attached to the uterus these tubes have fimbrias these fimbrias open around your ovary so suppose this is your ovary and egg is releasing from the ovary then these fimbrias capture those eggs which are released from the dominant follicles and that egg travels in your tubes with the help of the cilia now your egg has released so this process is called ovulation and what will happen to this egg now so this egg is there in your tube and now if you are making relation with your partner then male sperm will travel in the uterus and then with the help of uterus through the passage it will go to the tubes where that ova is waiting for the sperm so that lies with the ovum and and fertilization will happen and an embryo will be formed so what will happen to that bed this embryo will grow and then it will go and adhere to the endometrium and then pregnancy is positive what if it doesn't fertilize then we have the our menstrual cycle so this is the structure of ovulation and our menstrual cycle that's why it's very important to know our exact ovulation days so that chances of our pregnancy can be increased dear friends I hope I have given you exact answers about what ovulation is. Still, if you are having any queries, you can direct message me or leave your comments in the comment box. We will try to help you at our best level. Any queries related to infertility or ovulation or eggs horn or egg related issues, you can always contact us at Asha Ayurveda. Our contact number is nine eight double one double seven three double seven zero. Thank you.